time for this week's roundup of crimes caught on camera now, starting with a particularly violent assault. It's late Sunday night and revelers are milling outside a bar in Liverpool, but violence is about to disrupt the mood. A man is head-butted with such force he is catapulted from the entrance of the bar. He falls to the ground, but the two assailants keep going. One stamps on his head, while the other starts throwing punches. Luckily, some people try to defend the unconscious man, but one of the men still goes back for another kick. The two louts eventually leave the area and head towards Queen Square bus station. The victim had to be put in a medically induced coma, but fortunately has since made a full physical recovery. Don't tolerate such sickening violence. Call us now. This couple and their young daughter are having a look around a jewellery shop in Leicester. The man asks the assistant if his partner can try on a bracelet. But look closely. While he's distracting the shop assistant, he's swiping a ring from the cabinet. Have a look again. They quickly make their excuses and leave. The shop assistant later realised that a £4,000 ring had been taken. The pair are said to have Irish accents. Do you recognise them? We're at a bookies in Cambridge. It's quite late, so you have to be buzzed in if you want to place a bet. But these guys aren't waiting and kick the door open. One wields a machete, whilst the other shouts demands for money. The masked raiders follow the shop assistant into the office. They grab as much money as they can get their mitts on. Take a closer peek at them as they rip off the door lock to make their escape and run away with nearly a grand's worth of stolen wages. Someone must recognise them. Cast your mind back to December of last year. These two men are wandering past the entrance of a business park in Cromarsh, Gifford, Oxfordshire. One of them is holding a bag as they walk off the path and out of sight. When they next appear, they've had a costume change and are wearing matching tracksuits and caps. It looks like they're trying to work out how to get into the office block. Moments later, they're in. But it's not a social visit. They make threats to the petrified staff members. One of them even snaps an expensive laptop in half. The intimidating duo caused three and a half grand's worth of damage. If you know who they are, pick up the phone. Please call or text if you can name anyone we've just shown. Text will be charged at your standard message rate. And remember, you can follow all of the developments during the programme on our new live updates webpage.